Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever and whatever you are. My name is John, or Last Frontier Bricks, and welcome to episode 147 of this 100% playthrough of Lego Star Wars The Skywalker Saga. Last couple of episodes, we've been here on Mustafar, so I'm the goal for today is hopefully be able to finish everything up, and I think we should be able to do that. So, let's go ahead and get started. Alright. All right. Oh, right. I remember this one. Uh, password protocol. One of them doors is password protected. Only one droid knows the password. We'll be in quite a pickle if he if, if he ever went missing, eh? All right. So the door. Well. Oh, uh, the door that he that the droid need needs to open is this one. The answer is I have no idea where he is. Yeah, what we got here? Any join here? No. Alright, well, I already know he's not in that door. Because that's where we ended the last episode. What we found in there was a giant lava flea. And yes, it is a thing. Hey, Jubray, you okay? Ugh, it's so hot in here. I can feel my armor melting. I'm sweating so much, my helmet's all fogged up, and I can barely see. Uh, well, what do you expect? It's a lava planet. Wow. Don't do, don't look down. It's So, where's the droid? Oh, hang on. What are we here? Let's see, first order guy should be able to open this, right? Yep. All right. Down, up, l left, up. Uh oh, why are we here? Huh? <gasps> Battle draw, a uh, 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 dance party. I guess. So, let's see if we can't find this data card. Is it in the room? Oh, yep, there it is. That's why they have another solar grenade. Can't wear the one thing that the thing that's on top of it. So apparently it wasn't thrown away. Um, my guess is apparently it wasn't thrown away. It just got lost. Knock knock. Hmm. Not very VIP, if you ask me. But hey, we got ourselves. But hey, we got ourselves a cover break break room buggy. Yo, I gotta get a picture of this. Nice. Wait. Why are our separatist droids dancing out to a remix of the Imperial March? Wait. Wait, no, that's not Imperial March, that's Duel of Fates. S still, weird. But props to the, uh, props to the, uh, the, the remix here, that sounds awesome. Ah, 
Hey, why are you... Why am I messing around with that droid? Alright, so we still need to find the, uh, the Pasco. Hold for that area. Which is weird, it's usually right by the, d it's usually right by the area. Huh? Wait, what's that? I thought I saw something glowing up there. Oh, it's just a light. Okay, I thought my, I thought it might be uh, the, the the data card for Mustafar. Well, I guess I can always check to see if I've already got the passcode. Oh, well, let's see. What we got docking bay, Clutch A dining room, Java's palace, Death Star. Vehicle hangar, Canto Bite, Crate Service, Canto Bite again, Resident Closet, Descartes, Rear Storage, West Wing and Security Door, Zoom 327, Master Space Secret Safe, Front Door of our House, Mining Complex? Password accepted! How about that? How about that? <laughs> I had the I had the, uh, the best goat the whole time and I didn't even know it. <laughs> what a goof. Alright, what else we got around here? So close yet so Mustafar. You're heading to the lava pool, aren't you? If you're thinking of jumping across those uh, platforms to get that Kyber brick, then I suggest you reevaluate your desire for Kyber. <laughs> Oh, you have no idea how much I want that Kyber. Oops, uh, I want me to go this way. <laughs> What? Look out. Oh, I see what's going on. We gotta jump, uh, we, we gotta jump over the uh, platforms a la Anakin and Obi-Wan. So, for this challenge, we will do it a la Anakin. Well, um, its platforms will stay still long enough. Well, go. Oh, we actually have to jump onto that platform. Okay. <gasps> Ooh, that was close. <gasps> oh shoot! I can't do it as Anakin because it needs some good character to grapple. How about th now? How do you like that for luck? There we go. Oh, there we go. Don't bother me. Woo! That skill of mid-air grappling is certainly coming in handy here.
Whoa, wait, this is obsidian. Where's my kyber? You cannot be serious right now. What all the way over there for nothing? All the way over here for nothing? Okay, uh. Okay. So. This look at least it looks like this one will stay At least it looks like this one will stay put. Until uh, we formulate a plan. Oh, I see. We actually did need to be over there. There are platforms that float over the edge, edge of the over there. Oh. All right, so. Basically, what we need to do is wait for one of the platforms to get close and get close enough for me. I need to jump over to it. Oh, here might be helpful with Anakin. <gasps> Whew. That was too close. Too close. Oh, it's gonna be like this, huh? Ah! Dang it! Well, at least they put us right back on the platform. Oh man! All of a sudden, I'm starting to agree with the guy. He's saying we need, I mean to reevaluate my wish for Kyber. Well, at least they put us on the closer platform, so. Yay! One less death. One less near death experience jump. <gasps> Almost there. Almost there. One more. <gasps> no! And they weren't nice to us this time. How lovely. Oh, that got it. Huh? Well, um, that did it. Now I just have to get back down. Um, Bo-Katan? Hey, you got your just you got yourself a jetpack. Maybe you can fly me over. Uh, at least fly me close enough that. Not quite. Huh? Why do I need to go even higher? Oh, that's why. Lovely. All right. Well, let's get out. I see why they called it so close yet so Mustafar. <laughs> All right, somebody stop me! All the puns—they just never end. Uh, the Black Sun Gang haven't been here for years, but they were, uh, 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 but they were once for leaving treasure er, in their wake. There's something about uh, their uh, giant logo in that room, in that secret meeting room that screams, "I'm hiding treasure!" And it's actually the last of the uh, the puzzles here. 
Actually, yeah, now I think about it, they were, uh, Blackstone were here. Uh, that's actually who was in control of Mustafar, uh, when, uh, Maul, Savage, and, uh, the Death Watch were making their little private army. And back in the Clone Wars. It's so actually both Katans. About as good person as anybody you know, as anybody to do this. Cause she was she, cause she uh, she actually came here while the Boxen were in charge. You know until Maul created Crimson Dawn. Oh, this little secret medium. Oh, okay. You ain't getting past us. Get him! Hi, I'm Bo-Katan. <laughs> no, Clan Grees, Mandalorian. Have you met me? Hey, man. What's in here? Mando. Oops, wrong weapon. Huh? What's that? Was that a pinball machine? Hey, you know what? This table actually does look familiar. I wonder if, uh... Well, no table at the front, so... Although I am seeing quite a few... seats knocked down. But none of them are really missing their, uh... heads. Oh, okay, I see what's going on here. So, and again, where'd you go? Oh, right, I forgot. I switched you out for Bo-Katan. There we go. I wonder what sort of plants they got here. Oh, I recognize these plants. The I was say these were plant these were the plants for 3PO back in back on Tatooine. Huh. Nice little callback. Okay, this one goes here. Alright, now we need Astromech. Oops, there we go. Up and up. Um. Hello? Oh, there it is. So this one I actually didn't see where this one went. Uh Oh yay, put it in the right place. Goody. And now wait, no, yeah, yeah, I yeah, that's what we need. It open up. Alright. Hmm. 
Well, that's a secret pack passage to nowhere. So, where's the last piece? But seriously, that passage went nowhere. Just, just a secret, just a little secret way around the corner. Oh, there it is, okay. Right there on the table, silly me. I must be blind. There we go. And open sesame. All right, I blew, uh, I saw, all of a sudden I realized why they called it Sun Buddy Stop Me it's for Black Sun. Oh. I'm not sure if that's a wonderful pun or wonderfully terrible. All right. So I think that was all for the the puzzles. Let me double check real quick. Yep, that was the last one. Uh, how about facade missions? Okay, we do have a couple. Uh, first off, we got Musafar Runaway. Word on the lava street is that someone is trying to smuggle obsidian off of Musafar. Someone who has a surplus. Someone who has a surplus of obsidian. You wouldn't know anything about that, would you? Well, no, I said I wouldn't know. But uh, it gets us Rune Hako. Nice. Runehako being a uh, new gunray's second in command for the Trade Federation. Or at least the, inv uh, the Naboo invasion. Although, considering he was, uh. Considering we're getting him at Musafar, I'm guessing he died here too, so yeah. Oh, it's a smuggler mission! So let's make out Tatsu Leech! I told you before, I'm not up to any funny business. Do I look like the sort of person who'll be secretly supplying obsidian to the Republic? Sheesh. Oh, this guy was. So this guy was helping out the Republic. This seems this must also be, also be the guy who got the vulture droid. But let's see me in a position to be able to smuggle a supply to a contact near Coruscant. Purely hypothetical. Asking for a friend. It's funny, yeah. Funny you should ask. Kind of surprising that obsidian is rare in the Star Wars galaxy. It's basically just volcanic glass. It's not very, uh, not highly useful. Well, we've got this flying gonk at our disposal. Might as well use it. Next up, Coruscant. Well, I'm sure there are people oh, out there watching my channel who wanted to see this thing in action. Let's see how Oh yeah? Well, I guess we'll see how well this thing does in combat and in smuggling missions. Wanna pad? Ah, YT twenty four hundreds. Good shit. But hey, all the ships in the YT series are good. What can I say? Carly knows how knows how to make good cargo ships. Wave two coming up.
There we go. Hey, where'd you think you're going? That cargo belongs to us now. Says the guys whose ships I'm constantly blowing up. Yeah, uh oh. This may be anything look like a flying gong droid. Let's but that does And why no, this thing I can actually carry torpedoes. It's a miracle. Alright, come on, come on, yeah. On yourself. Uh, wave three? Yep, wave three. People tell me that twice already. They're all dead. Care to join them? Boom. Hey, he said it, not me. Well, these guys all have escape pods. They're gonna need them. Uh, you started off with a dozen ships. Now it's just you. Just make that it's just me now. Yeah, you ain't getting this cargo. And I'm and I'm not even bothering to use the torpedoes anymore. No, nope, we're in a clear. Here with the supplies from Mustafar. Take care of these guys, then we'll talk. What guys? Wait. Oh, those guys. Okay. I guess our contact's in trouble. Oh, it's V-Wing. Reappearance in uh, Mandalorian. But I think the I think we can all agree that the best reappearance was Ahmed Best. Oh, God, Ahmed makes for a pretty awesome Jedi. Ahmed Best, you are redeemed. And everybody always always, always make there was always say that Jar Jar was, er, was a Sith Lord. Come on, you gonna let me talk to you or what? There we go. You brought the obsidian. Appreciate it. This stuff is great for crafting and building things. The black doesn't really fit our usual color palette, but when needs must. Wow, I only just noticed something. It says it's supposed to be a Republic pilot, but they accidentally used a Resistance Trooper minifigure to, er, to, to depict him. Whoops on you, Lego. The guy on Mustafar doesn't usually take payment for this stuff, but, uh, well, looks like you went through quite the effort to get it to us, so here, and pass on our thanks. No problem. All right, that finishes Musta far, far away. All right, and that did get us Rune Hako. So let's go ahead and pick him up. Let's see, he was under the extras. All right, R. There he is, right there. Thirty-five thousand. 
The conniving Rune Huckle is the right-hand man of Viceroy New Gunray. As a high-ranking official of the Trade Federation, he was heavily involved in the invasion of Naboo and also sits on the Separatist Council with his com com compatriot De Gunray. Alright. So, let's go ahead and head back to Mustafar. Huh? The Flying Gong droid ain't as bad as I thought it would. Probably gonna be the only time I'm gonna use it during during, during the uh, the campaign, but hey, not too bad. Not too not too bad. All right, so there was one more side mission to take care of. Mustafar too dangerous, but you'll get us a Mustafarian. Hope everyone's favorite not smuggling Mustafarian isn't in any danger for not smuggling an obsidian. I'm sure separatists are on that after him. You should not go help him. Yeah, all those knots are making me question that. Uh, so, uh, would you guys be calling me crazy if I said I kind of saw a mission like this coming? I mean, you got, uh, someone can only do ooh, a bunch of shady, if, uh, good, s mm, good stuff without being caught. Wow, you ran all the way over here, huh? Oh, we need to leech again. Hey. Oh, wait, we need the leech again? Oh, no, don't tell me we're smuggling him off of Musafar now. <laughs> oh, it's you again. No time for the easy isn't he helping the Republic banner today. Separatists have discovered what I've been up to, and they are not happy about it. It's not safe for me here anymore, so I really need to get out of here. I know you've helped me a lot already, but can I ask you this one last favor? Smuggle me out of it. That's exactly what's happening here. Oh, man. Thanks, Fred. You're a lifesaver. First things first, we got to get to your ship without those battle droids catching me. Let's go. Yep. That's exactly what's happening. We are smuggling the guy out of here. Oh, man. How lovely. I think that heavy trooper is going to come in handy. Oh, I get it. This is like a... So yeah, I guess it's kind of like a gong escort mission and combined with a smuggling mission. Ah! You good? Oh, no, no, we're not done, we're not done! But now... Oh, you're not an attacker, you're just a talker, okay. Hey, uh, gonna get moving? There we go. Wow, oh, he's he's just scared of all battle droids, isn't he? Come on. That droid is going to be such a pain. Until he's outside of that droid. Come on. Do I have to push you? Okay, now he's moving.
Ah, more droids. Well, here's hoping they don't send like any like B2s or or uh, Jordicas. Oh, there's our but I was like, where's our buddy? There he is. Got a funny feeling we're gonna have a, one more encounter at the uh At the landing pad. Good thing is these be ones are easily broken. Hey, thanks for having me. I told you I told you that heavy trooper was gonna come in handy. So yeah, one more, probably one more encounter on the landing pad. Okay, okay, you guys are gonna. Okay, you guys are lucky. I'm gonna use this ship again. I'm gonna use this ship again. I was gonna say, I was thinking of switching up to IG 2000, but since we have to do this as a smuggler, IG uh, IG uh, well, I wanted to use the IG 2000 as IG 88, but since we, this is a smuggling mission, I uh, can't exactly use IG 88 for that. He's a bounty hunter. So, next up. Uh, the desert planet everyone uh, uh everyone just can't get away from well the other desert planet everyone can't get away from yeah forget Jack yeah forget Jakku why does everybody want to go back to J uh, tatooine Technically, he's technically he's not a def deserter. He's a defector. Vulture droids, really? Ah, uh, too late. I just blasted you. Wave one down. Wave two, coming up. So I got mid part. <laughs> so I got mid part. Me kind of wonders. Um. Like why we yeah, they why the we jump out of hyperspace every time there's another bunch of ships behind us? I mean I like do the the separatists like, like with the Empire at least it's kind of understandable that you can just say that they got an interdicted cruiser nearby. But what was the separatists? Uh, 
All right, let's go. Say I want one. You're the guys who make the puns. Uh -oh. Alright. Who oh, shoot me? They beat me to it. I was gonna say, uh, I'm the one who's blasting you guys. God, that's a... Eesh. Uh, sorry, I'll just let you have it. But seriously, that's the third time that they've said, hand over the cargo or prepare to be... Bl Not that B1s really have much luck. Come on, yeah. Thing is, so the vulture droids, it's kind of a waste of a torpedo. Oh, oh, they use them on. By the time you actually get a torpedo lock on them, you can get just, you've already shot them down. Mm, wait for? Nope, we're good. All right. So, speak to the Republic ship outside Tatooine. What Republic ship? Oh, probably that Republic ship. Another V-wing. You got the Mustafarian fella smuggled aboard. I'll take him from here. Probably safest if we talk more down on the planet. Come find us in Mos Espa, okay? Mos Espa, you got it. Oh, and once again, they messed up on the Republic pilot. This time they're using a Rebel pilot minifigure. Oh, <laughs> brother. Just goes to show, oh, uh, which, uh, it's Trilogy, e, the guys who made this game, and thinks this is the worst. Alright, welcome back to Mos Espa. Like I said, why does everybody want to go back to Tatooine? Alright, so here we are in Mos Espa. So, where do we go to... So, where do we go to talk to this guy? Papa, probably do this as, ta as a leech. He is the guy we we've been using the whole time. Not too, not too many though. The, the, the sun's scorching. Although I would say, uh, if we, uh, you might want to check out a pot race. Those things are awesome. We sure have some adventures, haven't we? I really can't thank you enough for all your help. But hopefully this will go part way to doing so. Stay in touch, partner. All right. So that finishes Mustafar too dangerous. And not only did we get Mustafarian out of that, but we also got ourselves a Kyper Brick. Nice. So let's go ahead and pick up that Mustafarian. Alright. G, J, L. There we go. Mustafarian. 35,000. They have to the planet Mustafar in the outer rim. The Mustafarian species are a hard wearing bar are a hard wearing bunch. The insectoids will work tirelessly in the dangerous uh, for hag mines and have to wear br breath masks in order to survive the hostile conditions. Alright, so 
We are basically done on Musafar, however, I don't Let's have the data card for this planet. So we're, I'm gonna. So we're gonna head back to Musafar real quick. Uh, once I remember which way the spaceport is. Oh man! And then we're gonna grab that data card. Uh, no, this ain't it. Okay, where? Where's the landing pad? There it is. Okay. Alright, back to Mustafar. Just go ahead and land. So, all we have to do is grab that data card. So, question of the day, where is it? Alright. Wait, okay, where do I go to? Challenges. Oh, is there? Is there a data card on Mustafar? Here, let's just let's just check the map. Oh, yep, there is a data card. Okay, uh, let's see. There it is. Alright, so, where are we going? Maybe I did see something going on here earlier. Hey, Rex, think you can reach that? Whoop. That's that one. How am I supposed to get up there? No! <laughs> it like it has the grapple option up there for just like a millisecond. Can I just like can I like, go up here and then drop down onto it? Like, oh, we've pulled off crazier so we've pulled off crazier stuff than this. Like I said. Yeah. And got it. Nice. Alright, so, that'll do it for this video. Thank you for joining me for it. If you guys enjoyed it, you, you know what to do. Hit the like, subscribe, notification buttons. Helps me out on YouTube algorithm. Uh, let me know down in the comments what you thought of today's video. Check out my channel and the entire Skywalker Saga playthrough playlist on the end screen in just a few seconds. And I'll see you all in the next video where we will be doing the free play version of the duel between Anakin and Obi-Wan. Later, everybody.